But like he committed assault. That's the only crime that you guys that he's done. Don't, Sean, don't. How is he a good driver? He's never he's never had the opportunity to drive. But then on top of that, with his one eye. This is a long road ahead song. This played at the end of episode one. Come on, Sean, stay awake. We're coming, Daniel, come on. Honestly, I should. Oh, look, finally the title card comes up. Listen, this, uh, this is what, an hour into this? I'm stressed already. All right, yeah, I'm gonna put the my phone right next to the monitor so I can use that as the chat. Ugh. You go all the way to Nevada from California without filling up a tank of gas? It's a good thing I didn't tell the, the nurse where we're going. But I mean, they're gonna find us somehow. You're out of gas, aren't you? <laughs> Listen, um, I don't know where you got that money from, but you're stressed, so do it. <laughs> Interesting. I, I wonder if we'll see Max in Life is Strange 1. Maybe maybe they'll kind of hint at tease it in the last episode because last episode should be a wild card. Fuck. Shit. Jeez. I will never hold him to Haven Point. It just sucks. Like, they're gonna find your card, man. Shit. Oh, I already clicked that, my bad. I will never hold him to Haven Point. <sighs> what a mess. Plotus can now add Grand Theft Auto to my file. That's what I'm saying, right? They already think that you killed the guy, so. It just sucks. It just sucks. Owner and stuff. Whose is this? She seems nice. Sorry I stole your car, guys. Shit. Guess I fucked up her day pretty bad. Oh, wow.
Come on. Did you interview everyone in that hospital? Or what? Wow. Guess I'm kind of lucky I stole a smoker's car. Oh, that I was about to say. Good. Mm, let's clean your eye first. All right. Careful. This is such like a movie. Like, what this angle is so. It feels like someone's watching you. Man, I should have listened to Joey. This is a mess. Okay. Haven pointed straight ahead. Just a few more hours drive. Where are you? That's the hospital? A full ticket gas? If that's where you are. A full ticket gas got you all the way there. A few more hours drive. Jeez, buddy. I don't even know how long I should keep on using this for. Take her card. Lone wolf. I think I'll take it just in case. Ooh, that's a good idea. Just in case we have to ditch the card. In case we have to ditch the card, we should have that so that people don't find it and be like, oh, let me call this person. Nope, 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 nope. Get some sleep. I never thought driving would be so exhausting. I think we looked at everything. Get some sleep. His life is messed up. His first time driving is escaping a hospital. Are you kidding me? <sighs> this guy's life sucks. You have hair? Well, this is a dream. Out of the century. Oh, he looks so innocent and sweet. You're with me, Sean? <laughs> yeah. Just zoning out. Oh, he did drive Just before. Just don't do that when you're driving, my son. So, uh, what's the verdict on the new car? I know it's not a new board, but it's got four hot wheels. Thanks for finishing it, Dad. A perfect reward for your excellent report card. <laughs> I'm proud, Sean. You don't even bullshit me when you need cash. And I'll try to be cool. No dad jokes, huh? I hope you're not too bummed out to go on a big road trip with your lovely papito, huh? <laughs> <laughs> oh, please. You're the coolest dad. He is. He honestly <laughs> is. Excuse me. <laughs> Where's my regular emotionless son? <laughs> <laughs> emotionless. Burn. Think we can hang out for five days without killing each other? Hell yeah. Haven't done that since I was a kid. Miss. Where's Daniel? So do I. Been too long since we went padre y hijo against the road. <laughs> Way too long. I love road trips. Look how he just hear. looks so innocent. By the way, boy. <sighs> oh. What's going on with that gin, huh? <laughs> Don't want to talk. Not much to talk about. Going okay. Mm, okay, so based on last time, he said he's not good at this. I would say going okay. I would say going okay. You know. 
going okay, I guess. That was like pulling teeth. Well, I've got a week to find out the truth. I kind of miss her. Wait, what is this? Where are we? It's over. Try out new stuff. I kind of miss her. Don't worry. It's okay. Don't worry about it. Not much to say. Okay, okay. Keep your secrets to yourself. I won't pry. Ah. Could that be Daniel? Hola. Hello. Everything okay, Lila? Oh, Daniel better not be giving you any sass. He's driving real, real <laughs> safe, like a grandma. Thanks for checking in. We'll buzz you when we hit the motel. Lila, you ready? Sounds good. And Sean, gentle, say hi. Girl <laughs> cannot wait to see you again. Oh, wow. Like someone is still thinking about you. Yeah. Oh. I know. Seriously, how are you really doing? I miss you. I feel like this is a dream. I'm going to say I've changed. I'm so different now. I don't even recognize myself. Because you've changed. It's like evolution. I know it hurts. <laughs> Big time. Guess I wasn't ready to change. I have total faith in you, Sean. Mm, episode your title. Ideas. You were born to roam and find your way home. God. I love you, Dad. Wish I would have told you more. You didn't have to tell me. You showed me. Oh. By the way, <gasps> Wake up! Huh? Huh? What? Yeah, what the fuck are you doing on our property? Huh? Oh, no. oh, man, I crashed hard. Oh, yeah? Come on out, boy. Who the fuck is that? A fucking kid. Get out. Look, I'm leaving, okay? Uh, no, you ain't. Step out or I'll call the cops. You don't want that, boy. Uh, what I do? <gasps> said out. Uh, we don't need cops to deal with assholes like you anyway. Listen, I don't want any trouble. Too late for that, boy. So tell us what the fuck you're doing on our land. I drove for so long. I I had to pull over to get some rest, you know. I swear. I had no idea this was your property. Why does trouble There's find him? Sign. Didn't you see it? I was too exhausted. I guess I missed it. He's just a kid and he's hurt. Look. Yeah? What happened to your eye? An accident. I got into an accident. Oh yeah? Uh-huh. Move it. <sighs> Please, I just want to go. Ho oh, ho, what's this? Drugs? Yeah, for my eye. Oh yeah, did you steal them? Like this car? I lost the well, keys. I lost my keys and my friend helped me start it. You mean you hotwired it? Holy cow, fucking car thief too. Take his backpack. Dude, come on. What the hell's wrong with you? Get it. Let's see what he's holding. Why does trouble always find this guy? Some people in life are just meant to suffer, and I'm sorry, it's Sean. So? Nothing good. Any money? 
fucking toys, man. You still play with toys? Seriously? It belongs to my brother. Leave it alone. Uh, here we go. A decision. Take it back. Do nothing. Uh... <laughs> this game stresses me out. I got that for him. No, you know what? I'm not I'm not taking this anymore. I'm not taking this BS anymore. I'm going to take it back. I'm sorry. I'm going to take it back because I got that for him in episode 1. And you guys keep just making bad things happen to him. So I don't care. Whoa, you did not. That's it, boy. You did not what? Try to take his his Get up. his thing back? Okay, Chad. We fucked with him. Let him go. He's got nothing. Hey. Hold on a sec, Mike. You speak Spanish, Pedro? Huh? Okay, what? here we go. What, what? Don't get me upset. Espanol. Oh, God. Chad. So, Professor, how do you say I'm a dirty thief? Oh, you don't want to share your language? <laughs> okay. Maybe you know this one. Uh, I'm a dirty thief with one eye. <laughs> no, just stop, please. Figures. You come here to steal but don't want to give back. All I want to do is learn Espanol. Might be our official language someday, right? See, si, senor? So, one more lesson. How do you say, this is not my country? <gasps> Fuck off. This is my country. <laughs> Did you hear that? Look, Chad, it's gonna rain. Let's go before we get soaked. No, we took the country back. Hold on. Are you are, are you fucking with me? You're really pissing me off, you know that? But I'm willing to give you one last chance to make things right. Sing something. What? Just pass the audition and you're free. We'll be very upset if you refuse. Are you Are you joking? No, 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 no. I don't care. I don't care. I don't care. This is degrading, and you already make bad stuff happen to him. I don't care. No. Really? Okay. I warned you, boy. Stop. Stop it, Chad. <gasps> oh, man. <sighs> Sean, I'm sorry. Holy cow, what are you doing? Listen, you little beaner. Get your shit and go. Now. Look, just drive straight and you'll hit the highway. Forget this happened, man, okay? I'm, oh my god, man, I hate this. I absolutely hate this. So the, the Wolf Brothers were split apart. 
The oldest wolf was badly hurt, but nothing could stop the wolf from following his brother's tracks. Oh, I just need to take a moment. I'm just like speechless right now. That really hurt. So degrading. I was not. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I let him get hurt, but I don't know what the other option would have been, but that is just so degrading. You guys like just make bad things happen to him. Oh my God, that actually really hurts. Happens so much that happens so often to people. He didn't start anything, and he just like. <sighs> no, Sean, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Sorry, Sean. Okay. Still a few hours away from Haven Point. Almost there. Oh. Well, I just want to just talk about that for a moment because it's just so sad. Because if he, if he were to fight back, it would just be the, the person. The, oh, it would just be. It would just like it's just such a racist. Oh, it just. I'm just speechless, like, cause that happens so much, and you hear that so often, and I hate, I hate hearing things like that. This is why I was crying in the first episode, and then for him to retaliate or do anything, would just add to their story, add to their narrative that he's the one who. And then it's just frustration, just screaming out. <sighs> My God. Shit, I need a break. Might be some shade at the next billboard. How do you write? How do you write stuff like this? Like it's so real. Like I just felt so frustrated. It's so degrading. To fight back is problematic, but then to give in is so degrading. And I'm sorry, I just couldn't. I couldn't. But you wanted me to sing? Wanted me to translate words for you in Spanish? 
that were degrading and uh, and lies, but no you. Board. And then I can rest a little. But this isn't right. your country. Yes. Shade. And you, oh, you arrogant assholes. But we took this country. Oh, man. My feet are killing me. Feels like hiking in hell. Drink some water, Sean. Oh, shit. My throat feels like sand. Let's just let's just take a break for a moment. Never drew a desert before. Huh. It's so empty and quiet. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. Look, you draw now. Don't think about anything else. You can even tell that the dotted lines have changed because of his eye. This place is so empty. Huh. At least I won't mess up perspective for once. Yeah. I guess that's an okay start. But I can keep going. Got a good picture of it. I'm ready to draw now. Okay, just draw now. Don't think about anything else. I guess I could spice things up a bit. Make the whole thing funnier. We're gonna keep positive. We're gonna keep positive, okay? I could try adding details. Focus a bit more. Got a good picture of it. We're gonna keep being positive. You know why? Now. Sorry, I've gotta zoom in a bit more. Hey, how's it going? Oh, we have the same name. How's it going, Isaac? Anyway, welcome to the cry session. <laughs> Where I'm crying right now. My eye always starts hurting when I focus for too long. Oh, man. We're going to stay positive. And you know why? Because <sighs> that's, that's, that's my Sean. Oh, man. I don't want you to give up. The desert just goes on forever. Jeez. All these power lines just seem, yeah, they seem to go on forever. Like, endless. Ugh. Yeah, it's also a better one to draw the oasis than hell. Oh, I don't want it to be so sad, man. Daniel better be okay. Feels like I haven't seen him in years. Of course I miss everything about him. Even his whining. And is yeah, not listening. You can wait to get out on your own. Oh, a wolf. Now you are. And it sucks. Oh, I think he's gone. Oh, poor guy. Don't worry about your feet. Just pace yourself. This is like episode one all over again, just 
endlessly walking. Oh, look, there's mushroom on my backpack. Gun stores, churches, casinos. Am I an actual snowflake? <sighs> you okay? Oh, shit, there's a truck coming. What? A Whoa. Is he honking at me? He's topping. Uh, okay, uh, be cool. Just uh, see what he wants. No, leave me alone. The way things are going right now, like, what other bad stuff? Like, it's like you guys have, like, this vision board, and you guys write everything bad that comes to your mind, and you just throw darts at it. And it's like, yep, happened to Sean. Leave me alone. Truckers can't be cops. Right. Try running? Running where? Oh my god. Like to him or away? Oh no, no, no. Okay, let's see if I just run away this way. Just get ready to run. <gasps> if he's a freak. How do I run? Whoa. Oh, shit. A snake? Better stick to the road. Oh my god. Oh, he best. Good, leave me alone. Who knows why that guy stopped? Maybe I dodged a bullet. Good. Because I, I was not going to stop. If this was me, I would not. I don't know. I don't do hitchhiking. Yeah, keep walking, Sean. Is this Haven Point? <laughs> Whatever the interaction was, I'll find out later when I watch other people play it. But right now, this is my shot. <laughs> about Easter. I completely lost track of time. There's people there. Hope those people are caring Christians. Like our grandparents. I thought I heard Daniel cry. But it was just that girl. I feel like I should sneak around, but like, yeah, it's obviously gonna interact here. You okay now? Is it gone? I, I think. Good. Scoot back inside now. Okay, Dad. Uh, hello there. Is everything all right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, don't worry. You here for the service? Ooh, what should I say? Yes, first time. I'm not going to let you know what my intentions are, because I don't trust anybody. Uh, yeah, I, I am, but it's my first time. Don't be shy. Everybody's welcome here, no matter who you are or where you're from. In his eyes, we are all equal. Plus, we have a pretty nice spread after the service. Stay as long as you want. Okay. Um, thanks. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'm just a vessel for our reverend. Thank her. 
Looks like you're here to see our new miracle, right? What miracle? Ooh, I should say sure. Sure. Uh, of course. Of course. So many new faces are coming to see him these days. He'll be here any minute now. Oh, no. Just come inside and see for yourself. It's Daniel. I know it's Daniel. Praise the Lord. I'm going to act like I know what's going on until... Why would you tell me to come inside but then close the door right after me? That poor little girl. Her cough sounds real bad. Her father was nice. Call. Maybe people won't judge me here. Can I take a quick peek before we go inside? Oh, yeah, he's limping. Poor guy. Yo, when this was Max, I would always be so nosy okay. and rewind time. Where are you, Daniel? Are you not letting me? Okay, I can still walk. I can't see anything. No. Guess it's time to go to church. Listen, if I can find out any information that would help me. Wonder how many people come and go through this place. The back door. Ooh. That would be nice. What are my options? To go in? <gasps> Enter through the back door? No, that's so suspicious to them. I'm gonna act like Nevada is like a giant slot machine. I'm gonna act like I know what's going on. But Nevada Unana. Half I mean my brother is in Nevada Unana. <laughs> hmm. Must be more kids here. Huh. Wonder if Daniel made friends. I like how ignorant Sean is, like, I mean, not push you too hard, but, um, the, the so miracle, to picture Daniel out here. the miracle is obviously Daniel. Okay, I feel like I shouldn't, can I still, like, wander around? Like, this game is making me, wa like, allow me to wander around so much. The church is probably the best place to look for him. Yeah. All right. I done my snooping. Every time I try to run as Sean, I just feel so bad. That, you know, okay. If I could meet the developers, this is a good question here. If I could meet the developers of the game or the writers. Why is itchy again? Oh, look at it. I can't scratch it, though. I would say, why do you keep making bad things happen to Sean? Like, what do you guys, like, get out of it? <laughs> yes, it's good writing, but Lord, Lord doesn't make me cry. But pun intended with the Lord. <laughs> okay, let's enter. I've done my snooping. No filming, thank you. Yep, Sean, Sean, oh, Daniel's in here. Cool Thank God for AC. Guestbook. Why are they talking about my brother like that? <gasps> He's showing his powers. That's what. That's what. Oh, praise be to Daniel, your friends. The oh no, we saw a miracle. <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> Fake. Someone said fake. Thank you, Holy Spirit, for the angel Daniel. He has arrived to clean the filth and sinners from this world. Bless his soul. Wonder how donations can pay for all of this. Nice picture. Who's that? I wonder if she's in charge of this community. Wonder if they'll let me in. I 
Wait. No way. That's Daniel? The angel Daniel? Oh, shit. Daily, noon, and 4 p.m. services. All are welcome. Oh, no. People will freak when they see me. Better clean up first, so I don't scare Daniel. It's funny I was thinking that I would just rush to Daniel. But I mean, you've got a good point, though. Let's look like you've not been beat up and gone through another traumatic experience. Like, do they have like a traumatic experience quota that they have to fill? Like, hey, let's let's have like five traumatic experiences before we greenlit this game. Claire had pretty much the same ones. <laughs> Cute. Oh no, that means that his mom is definitely the Revan. Hey, it's for charity. Me. <laughs> yeah, you're a, you're a charity case. A picnic with Daniel. Oh my gosh. What's going on? Come join Reverend Fisher and new disciple Daniel for a private picnic. All you can eat barbecue. Oh no. Good. If Daniel's here, at least it won't go viral. Let's see if I can spy first. Yes, thank you. Do we hear that word a lot? But faith is not just a word, my brothers and sisters. Oh no. What is faith? Remember Luke 18, 27. What is impossible for man is possible for God. With that righteous faith comes the salvation of your souls. Can you cross that invisible bridge to salvation? Do you want your soul to be saved, brothers and sisters? Oh, yes. You are not like all these sinners out there. So I never asked the Lord for a sign. Then... He gave me one. Oh no, it's Daniel. He spoke to me and told me that I was doing right. And to reward our great faith, the Lord sent me the ultimate gift. An angel. A child graced with the power of God. The miracle we have all been praying for. Waiting for. Can I get a hallelujah? Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Do you have faith in his power? Yes. Testify. Do you have faith in me? Mm, I don't like then you. Please welcome our newest member and our latest miracle, the angel Daniel. Praise you. Daniel! Here is Daniel. Oh, praise be the prophet who was thrown to the lions by false prophets. Oh, he's so cute. But God saved Daniel so he could do his work. Oh, hallelujah. Yes. Daniel was brought to me. I'm playing on to PC. Us. To guide us from the wilderness Praise to our destiny. I don't like this now guy. Daniel will reveal the true power of the Lord. Oh, 
Oh my gosh. Behold this miracle! Do you feel your soul rising like the cross? <laughs> Why is that guy crying? Oh no. Oh no, he's got them all fooled. He told him not to show anybody, and now everybody knows. With your own eyes. Now we have a voice, a messenger. Our flock keeps growing. I see more and more new faces. But this is only the beginning. You must spread the word. No. Bear witness. To this miracle. Thank you so much for coming. No, he's such an impressionable child. All of you. Amen. Praise you, Daniel. As our Reverend said, we do appreciate your kind donation. This helps us keep our church and to spread the word of God. Oh yeah, there's only a few tickets left for our picnic raffle next Sunday. Don't miss the child and another miracle. Any questions, please talk to me outside. Bless you for coming today. <laughs> oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man, oh man. What are we gonna do, Sean? What are we going to do? Hi. Oh, uh, hi. I saw you out in that parking lot earlier. <laughs> yep, that was me. I like to be here, too. We can see the whole room, and it's where our reverend mother teaches us classes. <coughs> Whoa. You okay? Need some water? Uh, uh, no. Sorry. I'm just kind of sick. Oh, that sucks. Uh, that's too bad. <coughs> hey, what happened to your eye? Well, that's a long story. That's okay. My name is Sarah Lee. What's yours? Aw, oh, you must be Jacob's sister. Did you get that letter from Jacob back when he was in California? Yes. <coughs> How did you know he was in California? I was with him. Uh, that's how we met. You are Daniel's brother? Really? He's always talking about you. Hey, uh, oh, he is. Not too loud. Uh, yes, I'm Daniel's brother, but I need some help. The Reverend Mother says we always have to help our neighbor. What do you need? Who is your Reverend? What is this place? What is Daniel doing here? Take me to Daniel. Let's find out some information first. Who's your Reverend? Who is this Reverend? You don't know her? That's our mother, Lisbeth. She was blessed by the hand of God when she was my age. <coughs> she can't ever sin. The Lord guides her. Mm, don't believe that. What is this place? This is our home. <laughs> our church and community. The Reverend Mother says we were all chosen by God. What is Daniel doing here? He's our miracle. And the Lord brought him right to our Reverend Mother. I like him. He's really kind and funny. We play together all the time. So, can you take me to Daniel? Oh, yes. He's gonna be so happy when he sees you. He missed you so much for his birthday. It will be like a late surprise.
understand Look at the donations. You're the living proof of their faith and mine. I know you understand. I guess I mean Sean? Oh my Sean! You came back! No I knew it. I yes, I had to You've come. Grown up and I know. Do I look older? What? What happened to your eye? Don't worry. It's okay. Did that happen at the farm? Because of me? I'm so sorry. No, no, no. It's okay. Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> Not your fault. Forget it. It wasn't your fault. I should have... It's okay. Does it... hurt? No. Itches, but it doesn't Not hurt. Not as much as your haircut. <laughs> It's different. I kind of like it. Sean, I didn't want to leave you there. Nothing I could do. I was so scared. And he got shot. I even thought you were dead. And... It's okay. We're together now. Yeah. Yes. So, are you going to stay with us now? Huh? I... We still need to go to Puerto Lobos. But don't say that too loud, man. We don't need to. We have a new home now. Don't oh, they brainwashed him. One step at a time, Daniel. Give Sean a chance to process this. I'm sure this is all so overwhelming. By the way, my name is Elizabeth Fisher. We all prayed for your safe return. Sean, you must be a believer now in our Lord, too. Kind of. Mm. Kind of. Daniel told me you had faith. That's how you got here. But first, I need Sarah Lee and Daniel to grab the medicine kit. We have to take care of our new guest. This is a place of healing. Aww. Let's do it later. I want to talk to him now. Daniel? Now. Okay, Reverend Mother. Let's go, Daniel. Whoa, whoa. Hold on. Girl, I would have been like, who no, are you telling... It's a pleasure to meet you. This is a real blessing today. Girl, shut up. You were away from Daniel for quite a while. I was in a coma. Of course. <laughs> I wasn't judging you. So what is your plan, Sean? This is a blessed family. And it would be good for Daniel to have you by his side. You should know that the Lord has big plans for him. No, we're not saying that. God or you. No, we're not going to egg her on. I'm not going to tell her that. Stay here for a while. Maybe. We're lying. I could stay here for a while. You know, I am impressed by your drive and devotion. But small is the gate and narrow the way. I've heard everything about your journey, Sean. Girl? And I cannot let a sinner like you into my community. I'm gonna Not punch somebody. Until you make penance. What? People Are keep blaming him for stuff. I'm sorry, my son. I'm not your son. And Daniel isn't gonna be your golden cow. Daniel, come on. Why don't we ask him what he wants to do? Do not touch me. Oh, please, pathetic. Fuck. You do. Nothing. Enough. You spilled blood. Ah. <gasps> in the Lord's home. Sean, what happened? Your brother came in here, impure and acting like a criminal. But he can be saved, Daniel. I'm sorry, Sean. She's right. I will pray for you. Oh no, they've and got him. When you're ready. We can't. She's trying to manipulate you. Let me lead you to the one true light that never goes out. I want to be your friend. You're crazy. Let's get out of here, Daniel. <clears throat> I want to stay. Just go. Oh. There's your answer, Sean. We're together again. So we can go, right? Come on. Get off me, dude. What? <sighs> Daniel! Uh. Let me go, asshole! <laughs> Daniel! 
They're not your family. Stop it. You just need to have faith. We'll be waiting. Daniel! It's okay, John. Sean. Daniel! Oh, good lord. There you go. Satisfied? Now don't you ever come back! What decision? Get up! I'm not letting people push him down. Come on, kid. Don't make me do this. You're not gonna win. Ugh. Daniel! Daniel! You're pissing me off. This is private property. Yep. I have a legal right to stop any intruders. You just carry that around, eh? I just want my brother. But he doesn't want you. He was brought here, and this is where he's staying. Next time, I will not hesitate to use this. Get out of here. I'm going to punch somebody in this game. Daniel, hey! Daniel. Sean. Karen. Uh. Get him back like this. Let's go. Trash. You're trash. What are you doing here? How'd you know to come here? You are a trash parent. You're a trash person. You're not gonna comfort your child? Did you not just see him get punched? Do you even care? Why the hell are you here? How did you find me? Well, um, I got a letter from uh, Jacob. He said you were missing and that Daniel needed help. I believed him. <laughs> wow. So you finally decided to check on him. Huh? You know, Sean. Sooner or later, we're going to have to talk. Where are we even going? I already have a hotel room. You're going to need to rest and clean that dressing. I feel like she knows something, but I still don't. I'm all for... I'm Team Sean. I'm Team Sean 100%. 110%. I don't care what these people have to say. This guy keeps getting pushed down and pushed down and we're not backing down, man. That's not who we are. Oh, stop. I wouldn't back down. So I'm not letting you back down, Sean. Keep getting up. She bought you clothes? This looks totally different from the picture that we saw before. Man. Didn't clean the pain away, but that felt good. Damn. You look bad. Yeah. 
Gotta change that dressing soon. Karen seems to be on the move quite often. Why is that? I think I know why, but I'm gonna hold out on saying it. Is there anything else in here? Listen, before we move on, I just want to say, if she has a good enough reason, I still will be wary of her because in this game, we don't trust. We do not trust, okay? But it just sucks, sucks ass that he has, that he lost a great, great, great parent, and now he's stuck with this potentially trashy one. All right, let's get into this. Of course she's not here. That gives me time to snoop though. Wonder how long Karen has been here. Listen, I don't give Did she see one of Daniel's miracles. <gasps> miracles. Let, let's snoop. This country is just way too big. So Karen did check it out. Yeah. Wonder if she saw Daniel in action. He wouldn't have known who she is. Yo, I don't care if she... Listen, we're gonna snoop. Kinda pretty. We have the right to snoop. You've been an absent parent. I if she made it. You have no right. I know I shouldn't peek, but... I'm glad to know she learned the lesson. Huh. Karen did her own road trip to get here. Yeah, from Arizona. What does that say? Turning forward to look back, making the same choice twice, twice, my solitude days and dreamy nights. Just to find myself looking forward to turn back, Karen. Girl, take a hike. Ooh, she has a notebook too. Karen does like to capture the world around her. Yo, let's let's dig in. Tracing closer every mile, my heart goes racing sore. I remember, know the feeling. There's no fighting back the beating, tearing apart my core. How, how, okay, before I get into what her poetry means, how dare you write poetry when you are a trash parent? All right, that's, that's out of my system. Early morning blues, coffee, red eye, truckers, and sad families, bad eggs at the waitress fault. She's a quick, hurried one, probably ending a long night shift. Tag says Clementine, 22-ish, redhead, dried brunette. What are you writing down? What is this? Casino token. Sorry. I still have no game. And the house always wins. Oh, look at his pants. Nope, nope. I meant to click on the Bible. I really should finish reading this someday. Not after the day you've had. I think we've both had... I've had enough of miracles. Huh. This isn't her tablet. Struggles with... What does it say? Struggles with too many open apps, but should be okay for basic browsing. Geolocat... Hope you find your son. Who did this? Yay, technology. She came prepared. Oh my gosh. Welcome to your new life at the Universal Uprising Church, Haven Point. Therefore, go and make disciples. Oh, all oh, Nate. They have all nations. 
baptizing them in the name of the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you. And surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. Matthew, Mission. Okay. A reverend mother doesn't look too humble. Spend her whole life as a humble disciple of the Lord. Please, you... Did you see the way that she dropped? She's like... Oh, like, he did not even touch you. He just was like, don't touch me. And she just... Like, no, you need an Oscar. You need an Oscar for that fall. And you even added blood. Please. Ugh. Garbage. Looks like a roach motel. But nobody will find me there. Hot dog man. Mustard party too. Play now. What does your garbage note say? You better have a, a good excuse. You better have a good story. Be right back. Ha! <laughs> we'll find out. Ha! <laughs> Popped out for supplies. I'll grab some food in case you want to eat. New socks and shorts in the bathroom. All yours if they fit. Might be a good time to contact Jacob. The number of the letter he sent. Be right back, Karen. What is this plan here? Jeez. It only took Supermom eight years to give a shit. Huh. Dear Miss Diaz. So she's... He knew. My name is Jacob and I worked with your son, Sean, and they don't have... Wow. So we have the P.O. box and Daniel kept it. Good for him. But he's in danger and that's when you came? Like, the dad being shot didn't tell you to step up and, like, take care of your kids? And then you, you told your parents, oh, please take care of them. They might come seek you out. Go seek out your kids. I don't understand how people bring people into this world and don't give a shit about them. I'm sorry. Trash. You've come a long, long way, buddy. Yes, we have. This thing is killing my back. I got bruises on my bruises. Oh, stop. $17? What assholes? They took your cash. I mean, you would have no use for in jail. Look how innocent my kid looks. Oh. Bet you would help me right now, bro. Wait, Brody? Oh, yeah. Brody. Oh, man, Brody. See, I got this back. When this mother effer grabbed Daniel's stuff, I just snapped. Oh, it's... It snapped. 
Oh man. Puerto Lobos. I'm so glad I didn't lose it. I feel like I've left of that. <laughs> Disturbed artist guy. What's even on this? Love it as pictures, but somehow this thing is still here. Why do I still keep those other wafers at home? place is quite remote. Good. At least nobody will be looking for me here. I'm not going out. No, I just want to see what the option Better is. wait for Karen in here. Yeah, wait for Karen that. Karen was always into low tech. I even think it's the one she had back then. Be said to call him, right? Be right back. We'll find out. She can... Looks like a roach motel. But... Nobody will find me there. Karen was always into... Didn't they say to call him? I guess we're gonna call him when Karen comes back. back then. Oh, the phone. Call Jacob. But why, when they can probably trace that it's been called from here? Hello? Jacob, it's me, Sean. Yeah. Where are you? You have to come here, Sean. I know. I'm not far. In a motel. Good. Listen, I, I can't talk right now. I gotta go. Wait! Daniel, how's he doing? Meet me tomorrow afternoon on Brandy Highway. There's a, a, a junction just above Haven Point. There's a, a, a wild mice ranch billboard there. I'll be there at four. Jacob, wait! What's going on? I need another cookie. I feel so drained after crying. <sighs> Damn. He couldn't really talk. All this is so messed up. This whole this whole season is messed up. Like y'all. Y'all doesn't know how to make me cry. <laughs> I'm so drained. Let's just rest while I wait for her. If she comes back. Huh. How She had the audacity to write in her letter, be right back. You were never back. back. Hey, sorry it took so long. Huh. The fucking store was packed. How are you feeling? Nothing broken? Altar boys don't fight fair? Yeah. I'm okay. Double cheese, no onion. Right? That'll do. You remembered his favorite order? Oh, you were so trash. You better have a good excuse. I would be like, who, who gave you the audacity to remember my favorite order? Got you some gauze and uh, antibacteria stuff for your eye. She looks sick. Hey, don't wolf that down. Or at least take a breath. <sighs> like you care. Sean, I do. Tell me why. Give me a good reason <sighs> Come on, why. Karen. 
Don't act all hurt. It's too late. Where were you when I broke my leg when I was 13? Huh? Not with me. Huh? When Daniel got a bad flu a couple years ago? Huh? He didn't sleep next to him every night. Huh? Where were you? Where were you? Fair enough. So let's talk, because we do have to get your brother out of a cult. I'm listening. Yeah, and it was a cult. How did you two survive alone on the road for that long? <laughs> Dad taught us? No, I'm not going to be petty, even though you know I am. <laughs> Got some help. We almost didn't. Let's be we practical. We just did. Kept moving. And nobody helped you along the way? You know, I don't have to answer your questions, right? You're right. So tell me what you want from me, Sean. Nothing, Karen. I mean, what do you want from me? Please A answer that. Hug? Hey, I just want you to know what I did and why. If you care. <sighs> Better be some good Ask excuse. What are you doing here? That's enough. Why did you leave? I really want to know. All right. Why did you bail on us? I wasn't meant to be a wife or a mother. Ugh, trash. I thought I was supposed to. I tried to pretend for many years, but I wasn't happy. You and weren't. The urge to leave just became unbearable. You're I trash. Had no choice. You're trash. Are you serious? You chose this life. You fell in love. You made your own choices, right? You, you. Making your own choices doesn't mean you can never fool yourself, Sean. After I had Daniel, you were about eight, and Esteban's garage was getting busy. There was so much going on around me, yet somehow I just felt that my own life was just slipping away. Pause for a second. Trash. You're trash. You are trash with a capital T. You brought life into this world, not once, but twice, and you, you all of a sudden decided to switch up? Switch up. No. I felt like an empty shell. Sean, it was the hardest decision I ever made. <laughs> I knew I might never see you all again, but I took that responsibility. Dumped us. No, I'm pissed. I'm pissed. To dump us. But I want to say dad knew. No, I already know that the dad knew. So dumped you just us. dumped us so you could be free? Yeah. Yes. That's exactly what I did. You're just so fucking selfish. You're garbage. I thought you maybe had some miracle powers like Daniel. You're, you're garbage. So what exactly are you doing in Nevada? You live around here? No. I'm uh, way out in Arizona. Sean, I told you. Your friend uh, Jacob wrote my P.O. box and said Daniel was in trouble. That's it. Arizona. Arizona? Holy shit. It's just lizards and rocks. Guess I found something there. Other than your kids that you, you brought into didn't existence? Really do me good, so. Yeah. Okay. Trash. Heard enough. Trash. I didn't have a choice, Sean. We only have one life. <gasps> and I didn't want mine to be spent in regrets. No. This story, this story, this story is getting too real for me. This is like... No, this is, this is, whoa. I'm trying not to cry right now. Oh my god, that's so sad. You didn't want to live your life with regrets, but you brought people into existence twice and you just left them. Oh, my God. And that you, you, you to be their mother would be a regret. Oh, my God. I can't. For years, I fooled myself. 
thinking I I'd find satisfaction into what society expected me to be, and that was my mistake. Are you I joking? You understand that. Are you joking? But I never stopped caring about you. Lies! Lies, 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 lies. Are you joking? Are you joking? So you hopefully one day he can understand. Do you know what he had to go through? Do you know what he had to be? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. His life didn't get put on pause. His life got derailed drastically. He had to become a parent. Wow. I am beyond us. I'm beyond. Beyond words. For what it's worth, I am sorry for hurting you and Daniel and Esteban. I know you're sorry. No, I'm not. Too, that's too late. Oh, please. It's too fucking late for that shit. He died. No matter what, you left your own kids and my dad. So don't even. I know it's too late. I just, I want you to know how I feel. Yeah. I still don't care. Jeez. That, whoa, what she said angered me. How do you have the balls to do it, but not only do it, but to say it? Say it again. You didn't even lie and change it the story. You said it. So you said that to your own child. There's people out there. There are people out there who are not meant to be parents. There's people out there who should not have the opportunity to give life. Sean, whatever you want to say to me, this is the time. Let's just get it all out in the open. See what happens. I mean... I get you wanted to leave and stuff, okay? But why would you ghost us like that? Not even a fucking birthday card. I just... I thought if I vanished, you would all move on. <laughs> I wanted to contact you guys so many times. I almost did. But you wanted a clean break from us. I didn't want to be a part-time, pissed-off mother. Not fair to any of you. I left when Daniel was still very young, so he wouldn't remember me. That's so bad. <sighs> you hurt him worse? Because he doesn't cool have anything. Man, Mom. You hurt Daniel way worse. He thought you took off because of him. Yeah. I know. I hope I can make it up to you, Daniel, someday. I can start by getting his ass out of that church, cult, whatever. So, what did you do when you left? Where did you go? I pursued some dreams. And failed. Good. Learned the lessons. I guess all this time I tried to find out what really matters to Which me. Which doesn't involve a husband and two kids. <laughs> it does to a lot of people. This is and jokes. I totally respect that. Just not to me. Kids. I wasn't good at making plans. Don't matter to you. Most of modern life is about, right? Are you joking? School, job, marriage. Ask my mom and dad. They wanted me to follow their rules, their faith. Oh, I tried, but I wanted to find my own way, with no security blanket. Family, religion, social norms. It's just all about security, after all. But it all just looked like a sweet golden jail to me. Oh, I tried to escape that. You are disgusting. That's... 
That's disgusting. You just sound immature, like a kid running away from home. You're right. I do. But I think people should know who they are, not fake it for anybody. So, did you ever actually miss us or dad? Of course, Sean. I do miss your father. He had such a big heart. Yeah, he big enough to be two parents. Dave. That was like his superpower. But above all, I missed watching you grow up. See how you saw the world. I, I can't. sharing these moments with you, Sean. We used to do so much. I don't know that. Your loss. Well, that's your loss. I don't expect you to believe me, but I mean it. Oh, I want to cry. <sighs> Whatever. You sound so careless. Yep. It's like you can't even realize how much pain you've caused. I do care. That's why I'm here. To help you and your brother. If I didn't step up to help him now, I couldn't live with myself. <sighs> Esteban hated when I smoked. He didn't want me to die an early death. Fuck. Life can be so cynical sometimes. I remember he would smoke sometimes. Long ago. We didn't fight much. But when we did, I would go out on the porch and light up so I could calm down. Esteban would come over and ask for a drag. Now we just look up at the sky and watch the stars. Or the planes. I do miss that. I used to do the same with my best friend, Lila. No. Sitting on the porch. Just letting time go. That's when you know someone is good to you. When you can just sit together. <laughs> shut the hell up and watch the universe do its own thing. Ah, you're, yeah, you're trying to make us think that it's you now. Please, oh man, this story just hits home. <sighs> wicked writing, wicked writing. I'm, each episode blows me away, but just the overall arc of everything is just... Wow. But Manal, this story is close. We should go back inside. I gotta change this dressing. Okay. Let's go. Sean, I know I can't change the past. Or what I did, but this is about helping your brother. You gotta trust me this one time. How? You need help though, Sean. I know. It's still hard. But yes. We have to be a team to rescue Daniel. 
we can do it. Okay. Uh, yeah, don't test me. <laughs> we need to get in touch with this Jacob. He obviously knows a lot more than us about the church. Well, I called him when you were out. We can meet with him tomorrow. Okay, good. I also got these, just in case. Okay. Better take care of the eye. So, do you need any help with that? <sighs> no. Sure. Yes. Thanks. So, you feel like telling me the story here? When we have time. Gotcha. You are so selfish and rude. You're like, oh, we gotta help Daniel, gotta help Daniel, make it up to Daniel. What about for Sean? What are you gonna do? I guess helping out Daniel's helping out Sean, doing it for Sean. Mm -hmm.